Hey guys, this is a reading to see what your person is doing or thinking in comparison to you. This is you versus them. And this is for March 10th through the 18th. This reading's for Gemini. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. And I am Pink, Arian, Gem. <clears throat> also known as Danny. Alright, guys. Let's see. What did you think about them and their relationship? What did Gemini think about this person and their relationship? Three cards want to stay out there. It's a lot. Queen of Swords. Hmm. Maybe this person was always trying to get to the bottom of something, always trying to read you. Um, maybe it just wasn't a lot of feelings involved. You guys didn't feel like it was really stable, but they they did something for your psyche here. This is uh, air energy, your energy, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy, um, but mm, not very emotional. I, I don't feel like there was a true emotional attachment. To this person I feel like you cared for them but I don't feel like um, you were all in like that or you didn't trust them <clears throat> there's a lack of trust there and I feel like both of you have experienced relationships where you've been hurt <clears throat> what did they think about Gemini in their relationship Seven of Coins. They were invested. Taurus Energy. They were definitely invested in you. Again, but it's not a Cups Energy. Um, maybe it was something that they felt like made sense to them to be with you. You know? What's currently going on for Gemini's? Okay, that one wanted to come out. It's actually, it's two. Ten of Cups and Seven of Cups. Huh. I feel like there's some happiness going on now. Um, but you're really not sure about this situation either. If you guys have gotten into another relationship, um, I, I feel like you're really not sure about that connection. There's something that's not allowing you to trust currently. But there's definitely something that's like, um, fulfilling you on an emotional level but there's a level of confusion around it this is Pisces Scorpio energy here hmm what's currently going on for the other person five of wands they're going through something they're battling something I feel like this is something um, inside them I feel like this person's angry. Maybe they're angry because they feel like you guys are happy and they're not. They've been waiting on you. They've been waiting on you to choose them. Hmm. What's influencing Gemini currently? What's influencing Gemini currently? What's influencing Gemini currently? Death. Ooh. Well, that's Scorpio energy as well. I feel like you guys are definitely changing. I don't know if the situation that you find yourself in currently, um, you feel like it's, it's not real. I do feel like your previous relationship that involved this situation you felt like it was real, but your emotions weren't overflowing in it, is a thing. And I feel you like um, changing and, and wanting to basically leave this behind to do something different. 
I don't know if you guys went to another relationship from this relationship or just being separate from somebody. Some of you got involved with something else and it just seemed too good to be true. And it's like coming to light that maybe this is too good to be true, that it was like a facade, it was a fantasy, you know. The grass is not greener on the other side, that type of thing. But it's something to that effect here. What's influencing the other person? What's influencing them? King of Cups. I feel like they love you. They love you. I'm feeling like this person messed up. They feel like they messed up. They are definitely angry. They feel like they poured a lot of emotions into you. And you guys always, like, you could not get on the same page. You were always butting heads. Um, this person, I feel, is currently pissed the fuck off here. Scorpio energy there. <clears throat> it's coming in for Gemini's. Three of Wands. You're waiting on somebody. That's Aries energy. You're expecting somebody. You're expecting something different. You're, you know, at this point, I feel like you guys um, know what you want. You know what you deserve in your life. And I feel like you're not settling. Even if somebody just like, oh, Jim and I, I love you, this, that, and the other, um, you're kind of seeing through the bullshit. Kind of like, okay, let me move this aside so I can see what's really going on here. And I feel like you guys are um, waiting on somebody else to change as well. You're waiting on somebody else to end something. You're waiting on somebody else to do something, to come towards you. To change their mind, even. It's coming in for the other person. It's coming in for the other person. Queen of Coins. There could definitely be somebody else that's coming in for them. Let me close this. It says coming in. It could definitely be another person that um, is coming in for them, somebody that's going to uh, care for them, um, be there for them. But I see them being more focused on being angry. I don't know if they'll be able to accept. I know the sun's shining on that. I don't know if they'll be able to accept uh, what anybody else has to offer to them because I think they are still stuck in the conflict that you guys had or why you broke up or why you're arguing um, they're stuck and so even if somebody else comes in their energy is uh, full of you so they're not going to be able to allow anyone in until they release and heal some of the the anger and the hurt that they experienced <clears throat> what can Jim and I expect from this person what can Jim and I expect from this person what can we expect from this person they'll flirt a little bit they'll show a little interest but I feel like this person is not going to come towards you. Could definitely be a fire energy here for you, Aries, Scorpio energy for, for you here. But um, they're not going to do more than that. I think, too, with the Three of Wands, they're actually looking for you to make a change as well. Okay? This may not be you waiting on them to make a change, this may be them waiting on you to decide to make a change, to end a relationship with someone else to come towards them okay 
<clears throat> what can the other person expect from Gemini? What can they expect from Gemini? Ooh, look at that, the star, that's beautiful. I feel like you guys are soulmates. But, you know, look at that glare. Um, soulmates, I, I don't know what type of soulmate you guys are. But um, I feel like we have several. And not everybody's meant to be with us until, you know, throughout this lifetime. But I definitely get that you guys are soulmates. I feel like um, uh, this person is a part of your destiny. They feel it. They know it. And I think you feel it too. That's Aquarius energy there. Okay, so that is what I have for you, and um, I'll be speaking with you guys soon. Bye.